Okay. And then just, I think the final thing we wanted to talk about was online assessment. And we know that a lot of students are, um, are thinking about assessment that's coming up. Um, and I just wanted to ask Stephen if you've got any advice or any thoughts around how students can be preparing for their online assessment. Yes, um, there's, there's two really distinct forms of online assessment that the university is going to be using. And that's online exams, which are kind of completed using a desktop, perhaps um, with short answers, MCQs, um, true or false questions that are completed within a short time frame um, and would have been very similar to the way in which they were tested within the university setting as well. Um, and the other form is uh, more open book or take home exams. And it's a slightly different style because the open book exam um, tends to incorporate longer answers, more essay style questions, in addition to, to short questions as well. And the big difference really, um, whereas the format of those exams may be fairly similar to the ones that you would face within the university, um, there has been an added emphasis on um, measuring skills like um, being able to critique, to calculate, construct, synthesize or analyze and those kind of higher order skills um, in, in the open book exams. And the idea really is that because you have access to your materials, to your notes, um, to resources that you may have from the library, um, that you'll be able to, to spend more time kind of uh, marshalling those ideas. So it's a slightly different tack and the preparation is therefore ever so slightly different as well. Um, I think one of the main things that people can do in preparation is to consider if, if certainly if past papers or sample questions are available, then to, to really analyze those and to practice and rehearse um, how you're going to use your materials in a situation where you have to construct um, an answer, whether it's a short or a longer answer. Um, you're going to have to, as I said, the more emphasis is being placed on um, tying those answers logically to the resources around you so familiarizing yourself through revision with the information that's going to be most pertinent to that module and actually going through the motions of making different arguments from different perspectives maybe not just relying on the the questions that have appeared in past papers but synthesizing your own questions based on um, the potential information that's going to be tested um, is a great way of familiarizing yourself with the the information at your fingertips and the ways of revising this i think um <clears throat> can be really helpful that that kind of rehearsal process can be really helpful for the time itself one big thing to be beware of with open book exams and we've we've seen this happen a couple with a couple of students when this has occurred before is that despite the fact or because of the fact you're allowed to have all your notes and books around you um it's often very useful to be quite selective over that which you draw upon in a, in the particular moment. Um, there's a there's a, a threat of being overwhelmed if you have every book, every journal taken from the library, stacks and stacks of notes around you at the time. Um, do make sure that for any particular modules exam, you do just have what's relevant on the table in front of you, so that you're not kind of getting lost in a sea of paper. Um, have relevant websites or journal articles bookmarked on your computer so you've got easy access to them and if necessary just use post-it notes or bookmarks to to highlight relevant sections in the text that you're going to be using on the day and again rehearsal of this and going through the motions well in advance of the actual exam will kind of get you used to to this new scenario that you find yourself in for these these particular tests that's great, Stephen. Thank you. And um, just to say, actually, um, assessment support week is the kind of final week um, before the holidays. So it's the week commencing 14th of December and the Academic Skills Centre will be um, putting on some workshops that week on online assessments. So um, please do sign up um, to, to join us for one of those sessions and get get some more um, advice and, and support from us from that. Um, thank you for everyone today just to talk through those topics. Um, we hope um, the advice is helpful. Thank you.